Okay, this is uh, shoulder traction kneeling, so we're gonna traction our shoulders in a kneeling position. It's weird how they name these things, so I'll never get my head around it. What we're gonna do is up, hips, knees, feet all nicely in line, okay? And I'm gonna reach forward, place my hands on the floor. Now, you see, I, without a shoulder problem, this isn't a hard exercise, but if you have a shoulder problem, it can be quite demanding. So if I lean forward at the hips, so I've got my shoulders just about above my hands, and I'm gonna push my fingers into the floor just to keep my hands in place. And then I'm gonna kneel back into like a crouched position. I'm gonna kneel back as far as I can. Now, if I have a shoulder problem and it's stopping me from doing this, I'm gonna take it to the point where I just feel it's starting to pull in my shoulder. So say that's here, it's just starting to pull, well, I'll just stop and I'll hang out there for 10 seconds. And then after 10 seconds, I'm gonna release it all the way through and I'm gonna go back. And maybe I can go a little bit further, maybe not, but I'll just hang out there again for 10 seconds. After 10 seconds, I'll come out and I'm gonna go again. And slowly, slowly, it should start to release and allow you to go a little bit further each time, but don't, don't, don't crank it so it's really painful. That's not good for you. Take it to mild discuss. I'll just feel it, just feel it. That's a little bit uncomfortable. That's where you wait. That's where you hang out. And you're going to do 10 to 12 a day, okay? And each time you may get a couple more degrees of movement, you know? And then the next day you go to do it, it'll be a bit better and a bit better each time. So 10 to 12, holding for 10 seconds, just on that point of discomfort, you know, uncomfortable, not painful, come out, go again, repeat, and keep going in that manner there.